feel good. I wake up in the morning energized. I used to eat like a lot of junk, a lot of McDonald's. The biggest obstacle for eating healthy is the environment. Like they don't have delis near them or supermarkets that have healthy and fresh products. I discuss healthy foods with my dad. He was a little overweight and he actually just got into a big accident. So after that, he had to lose a lot of weight. And because of the program, I was able to help him. He's at 250 now and he got 50 more pounds to go. I didn't knew that Swiss chard was a thing, that it was sweet, or scallions are related to onions. I said, Mom, that's not the way you cut the onions. They have different ways to cut the onions. So she said, oh, that was great, that you know now how to cut the onions, so you can help me now. Like the bear claw in the tunnel, I didn't know what that was before. Um, I also learned um, how to dice and slice and what's the difference between those two. And I also learned how to saute as well. <laughs> um, I also learned what a colander is because I, I didn't know what it was, to be honest. <laughs> the best part about teaching the young children, they would ask like, oh, are we making a french fries and like, you know, junk food? But then I would be like, no, you're going to see, but you're going to like it. And everything we made, they ate it. They just loved the food. That was the best part about it. I loved everything about teaching. It's just like, it's just awesome. I came early actually, just to see their smiles. I'm getting to know them, they're a really fun group, they're really respectful, and they're really creative. It made me feel like a role model, it made me feel special. It makes me feel like I could teach the other students what I learned. I used to go and just hang out, so I guess that did help me like, get off the streets and like be more involved into my school and then just the cooking program. Mm -hmm. So yeah, then that led to thinking more about college. I want to own bakeries, like all, all around the world. I want to be a doctor. So I have to know how to be healthy with that. I would open a store right near my house and you know, have a lot of healthy foods. Carrots are good. I like the veggie pasta and the zucchini and black bean taco. I'm gonna eat new things and it's just I wanna try everything at once. Learning how to cook on my own is gonna help me be on my own. My experience with the Sylvia Center really did influence me a lot. I grew more confident as a person. I'm a better speaker now. I know how to interact with people more. I actually started going to the gym because of Sylvia Center. It really changed my whole entire life.